to another video. Listen, in today's video, I want to set the record straight for you on a few things because I know that if you work from home in a home office all by yourself, just like I do, that when things don't go according to plan in business, you can start to blame yourself, think it's something you've done, question your worth and value and end up going down some kind of spirally, not pleasant <laughs> rabbit hole. I want to save you from doing that. So let me share with you a few fun facts about private practice that other private practice coaches just probably aren't sharing with you. <laughs> Number one, did you know that every time you send out an email, 80% of the people won't even bother to read it? That's right. 80%. If you're lucky, about 20% will read it. Um, now that's going to be different for everybody, but our industry average is an open rate of about 20%. But it gets worse. <laughs> Let's imagine you sent out that email and 20% of your audience or people on your list, your subscribers, open it. Guess how many are going to actually click on something? <laughs> Not many about three percent okay so if you include a link in your email to a checkout page or to a i don't know a wait list or to a blog post or something like that it doesn't matter what it is could be free could be paid only three percent of those twenty percent are actually going to click that button okay so it's nothing that you have done wrong the numbers look low because that's what the numbers are that's what the percentages are okay so it's you're not doing anything wrong um it'll be very unusual for everybody to open your email it'd be very unusual for everybody to click on links okay so no you are not doing anything wrong if those are your numbers and if you've got better numbers than that that's awesome like you are doing so 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 well the other thing is um for those of you who are selling perhaps an online course or a digital product something that's going to require a sales page maybe it's a retreat you're going to pour your heart and soul into making this sales page now i just banged one out this morning and when i say banged it took me from 9 a.m until well no that's not true it took me from about 9 30 a.m till about 1 p.m so we're looking at four hours to bang out a sales page but that's me being really experienced and knowing exactly what needs to go into one just being able to sit down and do this make the graphics make the mock-ups do that h1 the h2 um use the keywords all of the things right <laughs> you're going to spend days probably laboring over your sales page making sure it's just right making sure it's perfect having the right um, font the right font size making sure um, you've chosen bullets that are maybe check boxes instead of stars or instead of just boring dots and all this kind of stuff getting your branding right for it and guess what 98 percent of the people that see it aren't even going to buy they're going to see it and they're going to go not for me they're going to click out and that's normal that is normal. You're going to show it to 100 people and 98 of those people are going to go, you're right, I'll think about it, not for me. But two people will buy. That's normal. So if you're getting worried about your sales, if you're saying that the data is saying, oh, you've had a, you know, 100 people come and only two people... Uh, only two people have purchased you're doing well you're right where you need to be so the reason that I'm sharing this with you is because it's empowering to know this is just the reality of doing business the other thing that's really empowering to know is that every time you do something you're gonna have people that complain there are always gonna be people that complain you can't avoid it it's business it doesn't matter if it's gonna be something you give for nothing Maybe it's going to be something you give for $7. Maybe it's going to be a higher ticket program. Or maybe it's even going to be your own mentoring or coaching that you're doing. A package perhaps. And guess what? It's always going to be 3% of people that either complain, want a refund, call you every name under the sun, sent you horrible emails. <laughs> and you know what? It's nothing about you. It's a numbers game. This is just how it happens. So please understand you are right where you need to be if your numbers look kind of like this 
I would be patting myself on the back. You're obviously doing something right. If your numbers look better, that's awesome. <laughs> if you have any questions about any of what I'm sharing with you today, um, reach out and let me know because this is mindset stuff. You have to have the knowledge and the awareness so that you can pull yourself out of it because if you didn't know these numbers, you very well could be sitting there like so many other women in business just saying, Oh, what am I doing wrong? Why aren't I getting the sales? Da, 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 da. This isn't working for me. You could be in that position. I don't want that for you. I want you to get clear on this is normal. This is how it is. Okay. You are right where you need to be. You're doing all of the right things. You're not doing anything wrong. Okay. You're doing great. Don't stop. Keep going. Okay. If you need a hand with anything, of course, let me know. Talk to you in the next video tomorrow. Bye for now.